Gotta get in there close and find out what's happening. There's our ticket. Hey, boys. Look what I got here. Hey, where are the white women at? I like that. Be ready to attack Rock Ridge at noon tomorrow. Here's your badge. Badges? We don't need no stinking badges. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Qualifications? Stampeding cattle. That's not much of a crime. Through the Vatican? Kinky. Sign here. Oh. <coughs> Why, rat? How many times have I told you to wash up after weekly cross burning? <laughs> See, it's coming off. Oh. And now, for my next impression, Jesse Owens. Seize them! Catch them! Catch them! Hold up, men! We'll head them off at the pass! Head them off at the pass? I hate that cliché. <laughs> Okay, we're getting these two again, or these three. Carol, Darrell, and Dog. Why is Angela Kane trying to remind me over and over again that I lost my chaos? I can't watch this no more. I can't watch freaking Dog with Daryl and I ain't got my KK here. Yeah, let me help. This fucking stinks. Miss you, KK. All right, I ain't gonna try to bum y'all out. I'm just, you know, seeing dog and everything. Yeah, that's right. Give him something to drink. He's thirsty, too. Now, it's going to be funny if that woman, I forget her name, is still alive and Connie comes into the picture. So now, what the fuck Daryl going to do then? He might have to decide. All right, look, I'm not sure if I can take another episode with these two again. Okay, they're splitting up, which means this shit is going to be pretty fucking freaky. They're going to run into some shit. And he don't know which one to go with. Are you serious? You go with the nigga who brought you to the dance. You disrespectful little bitch. How you not going to go with Daryl? Oh, that's fucked up. Nice. KK would have definitely went with me. <laughs> That dog need a bath, though. <laughs> For real. What is that? A bloody scarf? I need to know the significance of that rag scarf she picked up. Why did she do that? 
can lay down. That apartment is nicer than mine. For the record, I didn't need an apology from him. I know he meant. You damn sure did. An apology is just a truce. It doesn't fix anything. Well, you did go all gung ho and shit. But I ain't mad at you. I mean, Batman would do the same thing. Spare no feelings, just get the job done. Then later be like, get over it. Jerry! I was thinking I'd work on the North Gate post today, and if things work out, I would maybe get into uh, cleaning the dead fish out of the fishery. What's that you got there? Oh, this. Uh, I found it in the street. <laughs> like somebody's period panties. <laughs> okay. I don't know. I thought I'd uh, try to get the stains out of it, maybe I'm in this little... Is that going to be a staple for the fucking spinoff of her and Daryl or something? Why not? Yeah, sure. Jerry, tell me how I can help out, please. Anything. Anything at all. Okay. <laughs> Jerry's like, all right. Thinking. <laughs> He's hungry. Food is important to thinking. And Jerry, a big dude. <laughs> He'll get some food. Yeah. Jerry goes start looking like Daryl. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, Jerry. Uh, one thing, a uh, bunch of Maggie's people are crashed in Michonne's kitchen, so. Not a problem. There's a hot pot in the pantry. Uh, yeah, I forgot. The solar panels are all messed mm. up, so. Whispers probably. So no juice. And we had to throw out a bunch of grain. Why is that? Rats. Damn. Anything else? What are you gonna make? I don't know. Maybe some soup. Yeah. <coughs> that should have turned into the kingdom. Nuts, mushroom. <coughs> make it work. You always do. Did you ever hear the story of stone soup? No, and I don't want to hear it now. To us in school. There was this hungry stranger that came to a village, but he didn't have anything to trade for food, except for a big rock. So he convinced all the villagers to try his world famous stone soup. But before that, he tells one person, hey, I'm gonna have to borrow some salt. And he tells another person, I'm just gonna need a little bit of onion, little by little. They all bought him this, enough and he that, made soup for everybody. Everyone in the village, until he has a real soup. And everyone's happy. Maybe Ezekiel and the others. I don't even think Jerry got the point of that story. It's gonna be saved. What the hell was that? What was that? That was gonna run into some trouble. We all know that he is. Because that's what Daryl does. He runs into trouble. <laughs> or strange women. <laughs> or he runs out of gas. Oh, no. He's got a bigger issue. Carol about to go fucking old school with it. She about to do like my grandmama used to do. Make soup out of just scraps. And it's gonna be good soup too. Oh, that was a mushroom. What the hell was that? Seaweed? Carol getting down, okay. What the hell was that now? Oh, that's dog. Hey! 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 Uh, 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 stop that! 
you have to establish dominance. That's what you have to do. You have to be calm and assertive. Take him for a 45 minute walk. Mess. Oh, he's just being a bad boy. Okay. All that's nervous behavior. No, I know. It's okay, buddy. It's just a rat. Oh, that's what it is. Oh, okay. I hear it too. It's the rats. Hey, no, no, no. You're gonna find them shits. No. Dog, dog, oh, and he knocked down the shit. No, no bad dog. Come on, pick that shit up and wash it off. Hurry up. Five second rule. Five second rule. Don't look at me like that. No, this is serious. Well, it's longer than five seconds, so it's too late now. Go. You found all that shit on the floor anyway. All you gotta do is pick it up and wash it off. Oh, she's making a rat trap. I think I found a solution to the mice in my house. Later, asshole. Is this lazy motherfucker gonna be doing shit? <laughs> That soup coming. Yeah. Great. Just need a couple more ingredients. Gonna go see what I can rustle up out there. Can rustle up some stuff. He said, "Look at her face." <laughs> she still could have washed that shit off. It's not like it was ruined. That's gonna bother me throughout this whole episode. Oh, here comes a Walker. Too bad you can't make Walker soup. Oh shit! It's mad at them shits, yo. Are you fucking serious? Where the fuck all they came from like that? I think I can't take you myself. All right, Carol, don't go fucking crazy, all right? First you. She gonna have a flashback. And you and you and you. And you. Yeah, find something to fix your bike. We'll find more parts. How lucky is this motherfucker just to run into a bunch of fucking abandoned cars? That got what he need. Yeah, that one's got a walker. That should be dumb funny if that shit pops up the fucking door. Pops up. Oh shit! That shit's about to crush you down. Get the fuck. Oh no! Stop moving. Is he actually talking to the shit? Really? Yeah, you should have took care of that shit first. I knew that shit was gonna cause some type of fucking trouble. Daryl, just move, man! Is this nigga crazy? Don't try that white boy shit again, yo, for real. Don't do that to me. What am I fucking getting worried for? He's not dying and neither is Carol. We already know this. But this show fucking... <laughs> this show gets you to forget that, yo. Sure you're okay? <laughs> oh, yeah. She put on that act like she did when Morgan was around. <laughs> Trying to put on the Jean, the, the, the Jean Cleaver, whatever fuck that bitch's name act. <laughs> Still didn't get that shit. She ain't gonna get that shit to the end of the episode. Watch. It's 
See, they gave us a Kyle and Daryl episode. They just gave us one where they're not actually together. They're going to just show us them two doing shit periodically through the episode. And you lost something. Oh, you gave it to Carol. You're looking for your fucking Swiss Army. Yeah, jackass. Oh, okay. That might work. <laughs> might be too big. I'm telling you, man. The DIY episode. <laughs> this is all about fixing it yourself. Home improvement. Should have called this episode. <laughs> Look at Handy Carol. That's right, Carol. Hook that shit up. You got taught well. <gasps> okay, that was the noise they needed to hear. Linda was like, shit. Is he lim oh, no, that car kind of landed on him, so if he's limping, I get it. But you can't see? now oh shit well, of course we know he's not gonna die or get bit or anything like that damn how you get fucking taken further from the knife and you on top of him What the other walkers that were behind you? Would they just fucking turn around and walk away? There we go. Oh, good job! This is just some lucky ass shit, huh? And here they come. They probably gonna have some shit, check. Remember, this is like video game shit. Get them double XP points, like I always say. <laughs> Got some ammo, more ammo. Hope you can get the guns to go with it soon enough. Alright, MacGyver, let's get this shit done. Save you some scraps. Oh, he drew it. <laughs> he dumb hungry. There go that rat. Well, she caught it. Oh, and you let him go. You gonna knock over the soup again? Don't, don't! You did that trying to catch up with your bare hands? You gonna start a plague if you get bit? <laughs> Fucking Tom and Jerry shit! <laughs> Dog is like, what the fuck are you doing? Do 
Don't worry. He'll come back. He always comes back. Of course he's gonna come back. You need him for the fucking spinoff. I don't. How many times do I have to explain this? What the fuck was that? Coyotes? Wolves? Now that rat is back. The rat is back. He's trying to tell you. I wanted to find that shit too. That scratching is getting on my fucking nerves. Are you serious? She did ass gonna end up knocking down the whole fucking wall to find a fucking rat. Remind me of that episode when Al Bundy was trying to kill that fucking rabbit. <laughs> Just stabbing up Daryl's wall. What the fuck is this crazy bitch doing? Are you dead ass? She's lost it. She's gone nuts. That's it. All of this over a fucking rat. How the fuck are you gonna explain any of this to Daryl? Be funny if that rat fucking jumped right on her fucking leg. And why does this music sound like a really slow version of Never Say Goodbye? Never Say Goodbye. That's what it sounds like. Okay. <laughs> the Kachari's like, what the fuck? It's fine, I'm fixing it. What's up? cover story was going to be that I was coming by for soup, but I'm not the best poker player. Poker? As in I've... No, no poker, poker face? face. <laughs> just going to fess up. Just checking on you. You think I need checking on? I do. Ezekiel over here to agree with me. I can't argue with that then. Wish I can check in on him too. Yeah, yeah sure he needs help. As fast as he can with the others. You know, probably just so he can check in on people almost as much as you do. Mm, yeah, yeah, I don't want to know what he's going through right now. Can't you just let people like me suffer in peace? Yeah, caring. It's a real problem. Aw. Jerry said just a big softy. Yesterday. He just give you a hug. Oh, come on. That's what he would say. Oh, and there goes the rat. Was that? Yeah. Yeah. That's what she was looking for the whole time. That nigga just left on his own. Soup's almost ready. <laughs> okay. Isn't that shit all bloody? Sorry. Okay. Hmm? Dog was like, no! I shouldn't have left you. I made a mistake. I'm never gonna stay with this crazy bitch ever again. So I'll ask you the same thing. You know, usual. Same. Did you find anything? Yeah. Yeah. How was he? Was he good? Hmm? <laughs> what? Caused a little bit of trouble. But he was alright. Hey, I made some soup for everyone. No, I'm alright. Thank you, though. Come on. Trying to beat. I'm gonna hit the sack, right? Yeah, me too. Come on.
Okay. So, now is The Walking Dead. Season 10. Episode 21. Um, wasn't the best episode. I could care less about this episode. Nothing in this episode really did anything for me. Um, the DIY episode was uh, the home improvement episode, I should say. The <clears throat> episode. <laughs> um, I don't know, man. This, this wasn't all that. It, it really wasn't all that. I mean, it was a calm episode, you know. Not running into, not running, into, not not running to any into any trouble, you know. No reapers and uh, no Commonwealth. We don't know what's going on with um, Yumiko and uh, Princess and Ezekiel and Eugene. Um, we ain't get no Maggie. We ain't get no Negan. So um, I'm assuming the next episode is probably going to be a banger, if anything. So you know. Like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, PW Hustle. No, my Twitter is 8 Track Dastardly, the number 8 T R A C, Dastardly. But sign up to the PW Hustle Facebook group if you get a chance, all right? So hit that notification button, flood that fucking comment section, let me know what you thought of this episode because I personally thought this episode was way the back. <laughs> that, that that's that's yeah I, I didn't like this episode I'm sorry I didn't like it I mean it's it was cool that you know not too much was going on not too much was coming at the characters but you know it was it was a little lame you know it was another episode of Daryl and Carol just not Daryl and Carol together they gave us them separately and I guess you know some people might give that a pass or whatever or might find you know the creativity in it to enjoy it um, I did enjoy it. I just just thought it was whack. Yeah, that was it. So, all right. Look at Mayhem back there. Act like she don't fucking... Hey. You good? Go find rats. Peace.